Alright guys, so with Windows 11 being recently announced to go live early July, basically one week from now, I thought it'd be a good idea to show you guys how to install it, so if this video does help you out, then feel free to help me out by dropping a like on it. Anyways, getting straight into it guys, firstly many of you will be wondering, is it free? And the answer to that is a simple yes if you do have Windows 10, which is obviously the current and previous version of Windows. Unfortunately, if you have any other operating system, like Windows 7, that is not Windows 10, guys, you will have to buy a license key. But anyway, just to make sure that you have got Windows 10, all you have to do is go onto your Windows 10 desktop like I am right here. You've got to click that icon at the bottom left corner, just a Windows 1. You've got to click on that little sentence cog. And then once this window does open up, all you've got to do is click on the right hand side where it says OS build and system info and under the Windows specifications, all you have to do is check what windows you're on and you should be on windows 10 in order to get it for free again if you're not on windows 10 like say you're on windows 7 windows xp who knows what windows version you're on um any of those you will have to pay for it but yeah guys if you are windows 10 like i am and like many of you will be you'll be able to upgrade it for free however before you do go to upgrade it which i will show you how to do in just a second you need to make sure that your system or computer has the minimum specifications to run Windows 11, which those are the following ones on screen right now. Your processor must have one gigahertz or faster with two or more cores compatible with a 62-bit processor. Uh, the memory must be four gigabytes of RAM. Remember guys, this is minimum. Uh, the storage, you must have at least 64 gigabytes of storage. For the graphics card, you must have DirectX 12 compatible graphics. Shouldn't really have a problem with that as most modern day graphics cards have this. And yeah, basically that's the, uh, like all of the minimum requirements you need. But if you guys do want further analysis, what you can do is you can download their app and just check it like that. It'll run it, it'll see if you're compatible, and boom, you should be good to go to install Windows 11. And once you guys are all good to go, all you've got to do is go over to your desktop right now. You've got to click on that Windows icon again in the bottom left corner, and then all you've got to do in here is type in Windows Update. Just simply check to see if there's a Windows 11 update available by pressing this button right here, check for updates. And as soon as the Windows 11 build does go live, again, it should be this week guys you'll see it pop up here and then you should be able to install i recommend checking this daily guys as it could go live like any minute this week so just keep double checking every day and that's exactly how you install windows 11 again once it does go live guys if this video did help you out then feel free to help me out by dropping a like on this video and i'll catch you all in the next one thanks for watching guys peace